guys, how's it going? And welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys had a wonderful day. I know I have. I've been off all day. But guys, if you don't know, we already got a uh, person here on the channel. Hey. Um, we made this yesterday. It is now Saturday. Um, if you've already seen it, then you've seen everything on the live video. But nonetheless, this is Warren. He works with me. If you've seen him on the channel, his name is Nitsu Gamer. That's what I say. Nitsu the Gamer. <laughs> now, um, so... He's here to review with me. He's uh, come over and helped me set up some stuff on the computer, fancy dancy stuff that I don't know how to do because I just drink. Um, and I hope it works. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a brand new bottle here. And actually, Pretty Lady helped pick this one out. Uh, the other day, we did the Grant review on the Scotch. Uh, and she decided that it would be easier for him to try something new that's a little bit sweeter. But this one isn't as sweet. This is a Captain Morgan Black Rum. Um, there's a little bit on it. It's... I think you said earlier, what was it, 94.6 proof, stronger than most of your other, like, uh, Captain Morgans, I think they're around the 80 range. Oh, that's um, crafted using only the finest Caribbean rum and select spices. Uh, the black rum is finished with double charred black oak barrels for the taste as bold as the legendary Buccaneer. And that's all that it says. Uh, finished and bottled in the United States, so that means it was made somewhere else, but then finished in the U.S. So it could have been made in the Caribbean, all this other fancy dancy stuff, but that final cap, that final cover, did not go on until it was in the U.S. Um, these, I'm also really terrible at opening these. <laughs> so, if you want to, you can tell them about your YouTube tubes and Twitch. Alright, so, I upload almost daily on YouTube. That's Nits with a Gamer YouTube. You look it up, I'm the first person that pops up. Um, I Links stream... will be in the description. Yes. I also stream on Twitch. Um, not so much daily. I'm going to try to do it at least every other day, if not daily. We play a variety of games. Monster Hunter, um, Call of Duty, Apex Legends, a little bit of everything. Um, been, been a bit of a Monster Hunter and Dark Souls kick, so that's what we're doing now. He's really struggling with that I'm bottle. Even, <laughs> I don't even see a perfect place to open this, and I don't even see a ripped to... I'm telling you, man. They know how it is. I have the absolute worst time when it comes to opening these things. You guys get the trash. So the, this cork's different than all the other Captain Morgan corks that I've seen. It actually has the CM on it. Um, really interesting, really cool. And it's a synthetic cork. See, it's like a, it's not like a real cork. It's kind of like a rubbery thing. Yeah. Hmm. A nice sound. <laughs> yeah, it's got a really nice sound to it. It's just a, and that's really cool. What I like about this one is the neck's just a little bit wider open, so it doesn't bubble as much when you pour it. It's a lot more wide compared to it's like some of your other ones. Dude, that's the private stock. Ooh, yeah, much more. It's kind of more narrow. Yeah, I see that. The neck shape really helps, helps with the pour as well. Mm -hmm. Because it allows, instead of like burping itself, it doesn't spit the drink back out. Yeah. But. See, that's the spice now. Something is going to be really spicy. Oh, yeah. It has because a, it's dark. It does. It has a. It's a black spice, so it does have that really nice spice to it. The Almost smell. Licorice. Because it reminds me of like the. Uh, like Kraken. Because Kraken's a dark rum. Mm -hmm. Reminds me of the uh, Cruising Black Strap. Gold Strap, it might be. I don't remember. Is it gold strap or black strap? Black okay. strap. Uh, they're really dark. They're almost toffee. Like the candies. Like yeah. the toffee candies. The rich. Let's give it a shot. See how it tastes. It's really clearing up my sinuses. It will. Oh, that's sweet. Ooh. It's a lot sweeter than what I anticipated, but it has a hefty burp. It does. I switched it around. Oh, buddy, my gums it's, are burning. <laughs> it's got a hefty alcohol burn on the inside. Like, it's almost like a cooling burn. Oh, kind of like a spearmint. Yeah, because yeah, like when you breathe in, it kind of burns all the way mm -hmm. through. It, can, it continuously goes, and it has a really nice lingering taste. It's oh, not yeah. over well, um, overbearing with like a black licorice or like a black candy. It's subtle. It's sweet. It's got a little bit of vanilla in there. Almost yeah. like pure vanilla extract like yeah. if you're from the south you don't ever make it because we don't get snow but <laughs> uh snow cream i've made snow cream it is amazing yes yeah, so that vanilla extract that you would use in that it's kind of the 
flavor that I'm getting that's kind of lingering around. It's like that vanilla. The vanilla, it kind of tastes a little little sweet, kind of like they used um, maybe fermented honey? Mm -hmm. Maybe a maple. Maple, like a maple? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It could be that double oak. Yeah, it so it's be. double charred and blackened oak barrels. So and that that's be, the kind of the, I'm getting kind of, I am getting the charred taste a little bit. Mm -hmm. It's got that rich, vibrant, uh, like, woodiness to it. It's mm -hmm. really good. It's very warm. I already felt mm. my face like yeah. warm up immediately. And that's the <laughs> higher proof too, because it's ninety six proof. So I mean, ninety four point six. So it's ninety four proof, almost ninety five, and that's hefty to sip on, but wonderful to sip on. Oh yeah. Um, could be used simply with a great cigar, maybe, or if you like to drink it, mix your drinks. This is definitely going to be one of your great Captain Cokes. Oh yeah. It'd go great with a Coke, a Pepsi, a Dr Pepper, maybe. A vanilla cream Ooh. or like a cream soda type drink something like that like a cream soda dr pepper yeah like those yeah the new uh, cream soda dr peppers or the cream soda cokes those might really 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 good together but it smells so much different than it tastes so these are called glen karen glasses the only reason why they say garden Mar grand marinere is because they come with the box but they're Glen Cairns, and they're made specifically for drinking and tasting and smelling of alcohol. Hmm. So what they're made, it's like a test tube. Your stuff bellows from the bottom, rolls up the glass, and then back up and out. Hmm. You get more of a smell, more of an aroma from it than you would in a straight open glass like one of those. Ah. Um, so when you smell it, and you put it to your nose, like when you, if you put your nose in it, it's going to give you like burn your nose hairs a little bit. But if you pull back to where it doesn't, that's where you get your real smell of the drink. Yeah. And that's what opens it up. And that's what they designed these for, is specifically to do that. Very interesting. And I, it took me forever to get glasses like this, too. Yeah, these are really nice. They're fancy dancy. Her mom bought me the flight bar, but Ooh. awesome, great tasting drink. But cheers, guys. We're going to finish this one off. great it is definitely great. a really good buy and it's only piss i forgot the receipt somewhere <laughs> captain morgan's not super expensive. i want to say it's like close like 25 30 dollars i think so yeah roughly in that ballpark um because i bought this and i bought the grants and it wasn't no more than like 40 couple dollars so it oh, wasn't yeah. expensive and the grants was 16 so i'm gonna say this is close to a 30 dollar bottle and i think well worth it and for you people that are out there that don't really do gluten and you're allergic to gluten, this is gluten-free. Oh. Um, I just now noticed that it says it at the bottom of the bottle that it's gluten-free. So more and more bottles that I'm seeing now are actually becoming more gluten-free. So that opens up a lot of variety for you guys that are glutinous, that can't have it or anything like that. I don't know if glutinous is the right word, but it it's going to be the word that I use. Um, uh, Anti-gluten. Um, <laughs> But guys, gluten intolerant. <laughs> gluten intolerant. <laughs> um, again, this is Warren. Go to check out his channels. They're going to be in the descriptions below. And as always, guys, hit that like button. Smash the comment section. If you like this, if you've had it before, if you mix it with anything, well, let us know. Because I'm definitely going to be curious on what you guys use this with. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Become part of our huge family. Grow every single day. Learn the numbers. Learn the knowledge, guys. But until later, thanks until always. I buy it so you guys don't have to. I, we try it so you guys don't have to. Y'all have a wonderful day. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. And you know what a day is? It's Friday. That means we're going live. And if you didn't know that, that means you hadn't hit the notification bell yet. Hit that notification bell. It lets you know when we go live, when we post videos. That's Monday, Wednesday, and Friday for them lives. Monday through Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday for those regular videos. We post every single day, 365, seven days a week. Guys, you know how it is, how it goes. I'll see you guys later with a bear. And Fireball Friday, guys. This is awesome. And we will see you guys later. See you later.